IPOP finally breaks silence on Soludo's attack. Read what they said. On the 31st of March, Sahara reporters reported that the former Central Bank of Nigerian Governor Professor Charles Soludo was attacked by unknown gunmen in Usofia, Agwata local government area of Anambra State. The ugly incident also took the lives of three police aides attached to Soludo. Ever since the incident happened, Nigerians have been reacting to and also dropping their respective social ideas. A few days ago, the Anambra State Police Command arrested five suspects in connection with the attack. However, some persons also linked the Eastern Security Network ESN and the indigenous people of Biafra IPOP to the attack. Not long ago, IPOP in a statement revealed that they have nothing to do with the attack on the ex-CBN governor. The group maintained that IPOP and Eastern Security Network remain a peaceful movement, seeking the total restoration of Biafra. IPOP also said that they have no issue with Soldo, adding that those that they had issue with has not been attacked. IPOP and Eastern Security Network do not indulge in kidnappings or killing people we are supposed to protect. We are confident to provide adequate security for our people, not to kill or kidnap them. We are not unknown gunmen. IPOP and Eastern Security Network are known group ready to fight for our upcoming kingdom, they said. It might interest you to know that the suspect arrested by Nigerian police force confessed to having actively taken part in the attack. They also claim responsibility for the abduction of the Commissioner for Public and Utilities, Mr. Emeka Isinwane. Thank you for listening to this news. They are everywhere. They are everywhere. Is it only Soludo? See, this issue of who is the government or, or, or um, those that are regarded as government, nothing has been done about them. Nothing. Someone yesterday, that was a DC city chairman, was saying jargons yesterday because he has been, he has been marked to be dismissed from office by his boss, Lai Muhammad, saying that uh, he has um, he have discovered that uh, IPOP are the real gunmen. Look at someone that is not serious. If you see unserious people, you will know. You know them by their by their fruit. And that is someone like that CCT chairman is very, very unserious. Very unserious. What is IPOP going to be having with um, with Soludo? They are they are even People that will help to protect people like Soludo. Soludo is one of their, is one of them. Soludo is from the southeast. Soludo is their father. Is one of their fathers. Is one of their sons. Is one of their brothers. So why would they want to uh, uh, attack such a person? And for what reason? What are they going to gain? So IPOP and Eastern Security Network are not out for things of such. Things like that, according to me, are distractions. So IPOP will not want to get itself distracted by things of that kind. They want to get themselves distracted because they don't, they don't have, they, they don't want to even have anything to do with dirty things. Yes, to them it is dirty, and so they won't even want to dip their hands into it. So people who are after the life of Solo knows themselves. And the, for the person that mentioned the name of IPOP, that person should be should be investigated as well. Very, very well. Because since it's an enemy of Biafran, it shows that definitely he will know something about the kidnap. Yes, uh -huh. he will know something about the kidnap. So he should be followed, he should be questioned, he should be challenged. So well, I'm telling you the truth. 
that is if we really want to if we really want to okay so i tell you my viewers that all this that has been happening in the southeast i tell you that ipop doesn't have a hand in it and there is every uh, assurance that uh, that uh, uh, the people who we are pointing accusing finger at are the people who knows nothing about it i was asking this question one time ago that we don't have anything like gunmen we don't have anything like uh, like uh, uh, like um, like uh, uh, what's it called bandits they are all headsmen yes they only give themselves the name headsmen in order to be able to gain entrance gain entrance into into the people so that the people will be able to see them as normal human beings not knowing that they are miscreants they are boko people they are killers you see that so they know what they did they know what they did they don't just want to uh, um, they, uh, display themselves they don't want to showcase and showcase themselves so they just they, uh, they just hide themselves they hide their identity okay why uh, functioning on different names you know when they strike in a particular place they call themselves gunmen when they strike here they call themselves book of people when they strike here they call themselves oh my god see we at the time has come for us to carry out a proper checking of these people and i'm sure that we will be able to come up with something reasonable at the end do you understand so that is just the humble truth about this okay so uh my dear viewers with all these that i've just been taking note of i believe that at least you may you may supposed to have gotten something reasonable from it okay so um whatsoever it is i encourage you to come in and air your own opinion okay click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you